All right, a very lovely video. And that's one now from one of the guests where we get inside the studio right now where they sit with us. Um, you can help us make welcome this morning. We get two hunk, hunks in the building. We get a Ken Dixon with it to my immediate left. And to my far left, we get Yummy. And both of them are artists in the industry. How on a day this morning? Very Every Friday, we're always very excited because they get artists in the house. Mm -hmm. They go tell us more about their career and then people to know them more um, on top of this particular show. So let me guys start with Ken Dix uh, Dixon, right? Yeah. So tell us, how music don't be for you? Music has been amazing because uh, it's something I do for, for just passion, it's not just the money. So, uh, it don't be all right. It's something I enjoy doing. Although it's not been easy, it's not been easy to, to you know, starting up like challenges and all that, but music has something where they speak me. All right, Yomi, I would like to ask you, how long you done the inside the entertainment industry? Um, five years now. Five years, now you done the inside the entertainment industry. How will it be to even penetrate into the industry? Uh, it's, it's very, very, it's kind of challenging, but if you're strong, I think you should. So, does it mean that those way they're strong and they feel actually break through in the music I'm industry. Those that are consistent. Consistent in terms of bringing out musical quality. Yeah. Okay, but I won't ask. Are you, are you shy? Because it can't be like say as you see <laughs> ladies. I mean, I know say you guys are not a good day when they talk when they when they gist. You guys, are, you know, what I'm saying, you know what I'm saying, you know. <laughs> Oh, I know we can't, we can't, we can't, but just help but um, admire Una because you guys are young, young people just like us in the industry. But mm -hmm. for Ken Dixon, tell us how, how a day for you because I know say so you be don't go to school or you still there inside school. I don't go to school. You, I'm a graduate. I graduated from Enugu State University. Enugu State University, and you be they do music when you be there for inside Enugu State University. Yeah, I was signed first. My first contract was in 2011. Your first. Contract. Contract. I was signed when I was 16 to the Imagine. Wow. At such a young age. But how your pal and Millet manager now? He wasn't, they don't, they don't really accept them, but they, at the point, they don't get option. You know, because I was even a medical student. I can't live and can't enter uh, biotechnology uh, because of music. So, they you know, by the idea, you know, say, uh, parents go, let's want me to so be doctor, those kinds of things. And my best friend even, and ended up being a medical doctor. All those things, you know, they pay my papa and mama then, but at the point, they don't get option now because my waiting I want is passion. It's something I, I believe I can do. I do, I'm good at, and I was picked up. It's not something, don't be sad, I just start time, say I won't begin to do music. I was just saying, you know, someone picked me up, so don't be saying I made choose. Huh? The music choose so before yourself. now, you be talk, say, um, just on the last question, you be talk, say, and you're doing music not for the money. Yeah. So are you trying to say that if, let's say, 10 years from now, you they produce good music, you are being consistent, like in talk, and you produce music and money not there, you go still stick to music? Yeah. I know, all the they, I, know, I know they're hungry now. I do all right. So How you take the all right? Do you have another source of income? Definitely. Okay, you do have another source of income? Yeah. Okay, so now for Yomi, I would like to ask you now, for, for you, um, without music, how you go for survive? What be your second? What be option B if music no be ever they exist for this world? Uh, I go get problem. Which kind of problem you go <laughs> get? Yeah, because it's only music for me. What it motivates you to go into the music industry? Um, I'd say my mother. Your mother. Yeah. Tell us about her. <laughs> okay. Um, she raised me obviously, and. Uh, I, I owe a lot of things to her for bringing me to the state that I'm in. And right now, I'm working on so many projects right now that will... I know in the next coming years, it will backfire and I'll be happy. Everybody will smile. Hmm. Well, are you in the, the music, you you like the music that, industry that to make your mom happy? No, that's not what okay. I said. Uh -huh. You say she raised you up, that she has done a lot of things for you. Are you saying you. that because of her? Because you of her, that you did that music. <laughs> <laughs> so I want to also understand, but... <laughs> No, that's not what I meant. Okay. I, I, what, I'm, what I'm trying to say is, uh, you asked me... Um, I said, what motivated you to go into the music industry? Oh, 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 oh okay. Um, basically, my passion is what I've had well, since when I was a kid. And you music, don't see any other music. artist who just motivate you? Huh? Oh, okay. Yeah, Two-Face. Okay. I see a lot of good music in Two-Face. And I, try, I want to emulate that. And I want people to see that in, like, on my part. 
Okay, so can Kenny Dixon tell us about this your music where you get why you decide to go into this genre of music where you the inside? Okay, definitely. I I don't I don't specify. In, I don't have a specific genre of music. So you do anything as yeah, the as the breeze they blow you the enter. Good music. That's what I tell them. Yeah. General music. I so that. this is just part of part of what I can do. You understand? Just a, a section of it. Whereby you know, it's an R and B talk about you being influenced by environment. You understand? They talk about love, which is and the, the this music or your music video will just play so it's, it's, what's it talking about exactly? I love now. You know, here. Uh -huh. <laughs> I love music. You know what? Let me hold you there, Ken Kenny now. You know I mean you talk about um Two Face being an influence yeah. in your musical career. Yeah. I want to see your musical video and find out if really you get some tiny elements Elemental. of two faces two style inside them. Let's see your music video. Okay, but I need to understand the way. Is that was that shaku shaku or was that a tiki or what? I know not to that shaku shaku side. They add my own bini style into her. Shaku 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 bini. So, l watching the song, I wonder what genre of music are you into? Uh, I'm a reggae dancehall artist, but I infuse um, Afro pop into it. Mm, yeah. Nice one. Is this like your first musical video? Yeah, this is your first, my first one. Yeah, my first video. When you release them? This year. This year. February. Yeah. Okay, how's the reception been so far? Ah, it's been, it's been lovely. People have actually showed me love on it. Okay, now I'd like to ask two of you um, the same question, but I'll go one, one make Ken, Ken Dixon answer from first. Now, some people, they come outside, they talk, say, for up-and-coming artists to enter into the industry, say a lot of A-list artists, you know, they give them that opportunity to shine or to show themselves or to show their talent. How true this one be? Since when, I just, since when I, they don't enter the industry and you've been there for at least five years. So how has it been for you, Ken Dixon? Do A-list artists one thing give I you opportunities? Believe, yeah, one thing I believe is it's all about individual differences, you know what I'm saying? So mainly the artist will accept you, and it, it all depends on your song and your personality. If if they have, if their heart accepts you, they will show you love. It's not all I mean that's projecting out. That's, that's that's projected too many artists. Mm -hmm. Davido, Whiskey, and too many others. So I don't believe in that one. Okay, and yeah. for you, Yami? I feel the same. Um, I feel this, the early artists, they, they are doing justice to it. They are doing good. You don't try to reach out to Two Face? Um, not yet. <laughs> <laughs> so hopefully we will see a yeah, music of you in collaboration with Two Face. Yeah. But thank you so much, Yem, Yomi, and uh, Ken Dixon. Ken Dixon. What do you want on social media handles for people to follow now? I am Ken Dixon, both Instagram and Twitter. And Twitter. What, where do you get your music? Uh, on all the platforms. All the platforms. And Yomi, your handle? Yeah, my Instagram is uh, at Yomi Official, at Y-O-M-M-Y Official. Okay. And on your Twitter, music? On Twitter is at Yomi of, uh, on, Online, at Y-O-M-M-Y Online. Then my music, you can get on, my video is on YouTube. On okay. YouTube? On, on, on all platforms. All right, yeah. we're going to need to come out to support our very own people. We have to, yeah. we have so to, much. we have to support them. That's not why we always bring them every Friday. But thank you so much, and we wish you all the best in your career. Yeah, thank you. To enjoy more of this, our Ugonke videos when you just watch, press this button to subscribe on top of our YouTube.